Our high school strength and conditioning program at Raw was something that we found to be a necessity. Walk underneath. Come all the way down. All the way down. Shoulders up. Now stand up. Stand straight up. That's where we want that bar to sit. Okay? Now the trick is getting it up here. Right? Okay. Now set it back down. One of our goals when organizing and putting together our high school strength and conditioning program is to work collectively with the coach. At RAW, we're able to break down the movement patterns, the lifts, designate workload, work on movement patterns and flexibility, getting them a stronger athlete from head to toe. So when they go see their coach for their preseason or for their off-season workouts, the coach actually has a stronger athlete to work with, allowing more time to work on their specific sport. So everybody has their push press weights, their kettlebell for their sumo deadlift high pull, and you have everybody has their very own box jump for 12. In seven minutes, we want to see how many times you can get through these three skills. Okay, so five, seven, 12, go for seven minutes. Starting in three, two, one, go! We want to leave these athletes with an understanding not only that what they're about to embark on is physically demanding, their physical fitness is also mentally demanding. We want to use RAW as a way where they learn how to back squat, front squat, overhead press correctly, use kettlebells correctly. And then they're physically prepared, they can go into their preseason, not worrying about, am I going to get through the practice? They can focus on learning the plays. And it's really, it's a win-win for the coach and for the athlete. You know, the warm-up is crucial. The warm-up that we do in all of our workouts here at RAW not only is it an assessment tool for our individual clients, it basically helps us where are they lacking and where are they good, where are their strengths and where are their weaknesses. We give you a skill, you're going to do that skill, and then you're going to just do a nice light jog back, okay? So our warm-up is a good 20 minutes and we go through different drills, different movement patterns, through all ranges of motion from head to toe, front and back. We finish with some, some core work. We finish with some range of motion, joint integrity work, front, working the back as well. Building that GPP with body weight movements, that general physical preparedness that will only transfer into their lifts and into their movements when they see their coach. We end each session with nutrition. These high school athletes have to understand that they can work 110% in the gym for their coach. They've got to respect and treat their body and eat like an athlete. And we want to take the brain work and the guesswork out of it for them and out of it for their coaches and their parents with easy meals, easy snacks on the go, um, easy food, nutrition that they can take with them when they're traveling to their games. We love working with these high school athletes. They come in, they're ready to work. They want to get better for themselves, for their team, for their coaches. It's a great thing at the end of the day when we, we get a note from a coach. They recognize not only that how their body looks when they come to their preseason, but also how their body is moving. And that's really what it comes down to, is movement patterns, range of motion, building confidence, mental toughness, and athletic prowess is what our training program, our high school strength and conditioning program is about here at Roth.